I've been really excited to try this game out since its inception and all the videos that came out. So, you know, I wanted to give it a little whirl. Uh, I'm not going to lie. Like when I first started playing it, I wasn't like the best. I had to make it work. I first went to drift school, get a hold of like the physics and all that stuff. Because once you start out on a new game, you know, you're not going to be like the greatest or whatever. You have to figure out what's going on here. So fresh off a of car X, you know, you got to remember that like counter steering is not a thing. So in this game, you got to like, you know, actually work it and trust the car when it slides out and all that stuff. Uh, you know, I can admit, like, I'm not the greatest player. I'm not the best player. I mean, I did this all on my Xbox controller. From the experience I had playing this game, it was pretty fun. I'm not going to lie. Um, it was good to, like, have a refreshing thing to come to. Like, the, the whole environment looks nice. Like, everything about the setting, like, is what we wanted in a car game in a long time. Yeah, the physics aren't the greatest, but it can be improved upon. Plus, like, I'm pretty sure in the future they're going to add more parts and more things to make your car slide a little bit better and all that type of stuff. Because this is just a free demo. I'm pretty sure it's still out on Steam for everybody else. Now, I think I know I'm, like, a little late to the party, but I wanted to, like, get my uh, impressions in on the game while it was out. I I I'm pretty impressed with what the presentation of this game brings. I'm here at the drift school, and I'm going to cut straight to one of my laps that I did because I did way too many to count and I wanted to make sure this video wasn't gonna run too long. So I did my best. Um, you can judge it however you want to judge it, but I, I think I did my best, especially like I still haven't found like the right setting or tune yet on this car to get it sliding how I want it to, but it's still a new game. So I'm not even gonna trip too hard over that. One thing that I'm not a fan of is the button configuration off the rip because for some reason your handbrake is Y and your clutch is A or if you're on like a PlayStation controller your handbrake is triangle and your clutch is X and that's a really like uncomfortable setting especially if you're trying to like get into like quick gear shifts and all that stuff so when the full game comes out and button configuration is a thing I'll definitely change it to something more comfortable or Hopefully, if you guys are going to update the demo at some point in time, just make the clutch a bumper button and make the handbrake maybe X or A, you know, because that, that's just more comfortable, at least in my sense, because I came from playing Forza Horizon. That's how I learned how to like play drifting or learn how to drift in games in general. That's how I started. But that was like a long time ago, and that's followed me all the way to Car X. For a small development team, they actually nailed it out of the park when it came to like a JDM, you know, Japanese focused game. Because I've been like wanting that for a really long time. Like it's been really, really annoying, especially with the landscape of games that we have now. It's just been like shoving supercars and all these other Euro cars down our throats. And I'm not saying supercars like are annoying and they're like stupid. I like supercars, Lamborghinis and Ferraris. Oh, they're cool, but when you want to play in a game you know that coexists with those other cars it's kind of tough because you know you have the toxic drivers and they can get really annoying especially like if you're trying to do something on your own or have fun they're going to come around and make it seem like you're not doing anything at all and it's so stupid but that's how usually the community works for some reason but i love the fact that there's a jdm focus game for once like for a long time I know Car X is mostly like a JDM focused game, but they've been starting to veer into that like Forza territory with like uh, supercars and all that extra stuff. And it's not a bad thing. It's just, you know, they need some variety to their game and I understand that. But for this, this is exactly the environment and the atmosphere and the type of cars I would love to play in this game. And also, dear developers, if you hear me, please add the Toyota Chaser. I'm not saying the Mark II, I'm not saying the Cresta, just add the Chaser. I mean, if you don't, it's all good, but I would really love you guys to add that car to the game because that's just the one car I usually call to when I'm ever I'm playing a car game in general. Like, if a car game doesn't have it, I usually don't want to play it. That's how I see it. They really did a good job on the car sounds as well. I'm loving the different varieties in road and, like, all the elevation changes and the curves and everything. Also, like, one thing to know I would feel that would make this game a little bit better is, uh better chase camera like maybe take for instance uh Assetto Corza and their default chase camera will probably do this game a lot of like you know good justice when it comes to drifting because you know dictating how far out your turn 
or like how far out you're drifting it will really help you out and not spin out and all that type of stuff but uh even first person is really good honestly i can argue that drifting in first person is somewhat better than like the third person camera and i usually love to drift in third person but honestly like you guys are doing a really good job like definitely gonna be excited for what comes next for this game i'll definitely be getting the full game for sure now coming to the highway section the highway looks really good really really good like i'm impressed i love how the highway looks i love the on ramp that's how it's like in a little loop but I mean, I get it, it's the demo, but to make the highway better, add more traffic. Like, add more traffic, and it'll be the it'll be the no hezzy without having to do like the millions and millions of mods on everybody's computer. Like, the highway is perfect. They're, like, it's amazing. Like, it has enough straights and it has enough curves and turns and it has a tunnel. Also, I didn't really notice uh, a tunnel sound going into it, but. I'm pretty sure they will like maybe take note of that and change that later. There's a weird ghosting effect when you're driving as well, but this is all beta, so like I'm not really gonna trip too hard, but these are just little notes that I'm putting on the side for when it comes to the game in general, what other flaws I can find. But honestly, there's not that many flaws to this game. Like it's it's really good. I mean, yeah, the, the drifting physics can be working on a little bit, you know, just a little bit maybe, nothing too crazy, maybe a little bit, you know, parts here and there to make, you know, cars slide a little bit different or better however you want it to, but the game feels really good. It feels really refreshing to play something like this. The environment and everything just looks really nice. The foliage, the, the vegetation, everything, it just looks really good. Like, I'm, I'm blown away by how good this game looks, and I think at some point in time I did have to turn my graphics down because I had like a lag issue for a second, but it, it, even then it still runs really good and it looks really nice. Like even if you have like, like I guess middle graphic settings and it just, it just looks really good. I, I, I love this game. I would love to play it more. I'm going to try to see if I can find another setting or more tune settings to make the car slide a little bit more than I want it to. I know it's also a gearing thing as well, but this game is really good. It has a lot of potential to like do something, especially really make a like a wave, impactful wave in this like demographic of games now, then because we're, we're really limited. I'm not going to lie. But that was JDM Driftmaster. Uh, I will definitely see you guys soon on the next upload. I'm sorry I haven't been uploading recently. Just a lot of stuff going on in my personal life. So, you know, just hang tight. New content's coming soon. So for now, much love. Peace.